In this video, I'd like to talk about the 682 Synergy Plus and the batching opportunities that it has to offer. The 682 comes with eight set points that you're able to configure in either a free running or batching fashion. It also has soft keys that you can set for batching functions of various types, such as starting, stopping, resetting, or pausing your routine. Let's go ahead and hop in the menu and take a closer look. So we'll begin by pressing our configuration switch on the bottom of the unit, get into the menu. From configuration, I'm going to go to the right until I find set point. And when I navigate down into this particular menu, I'm going to start by seeing two different parameters here, batching and set point configuration. Now underneath batching, this is what we would typically refer to as our global batching parameter. By default, this is turned off, but I can set it up in an automatic or manual restart configuration here. Under set point configuration, this is where I'm going to access the eight different set points that we have available. Let's take a look at set point number one. Initially, when I come down, I'm going to be presented with an option to indicate what kind of set point we want to set up. And we've got quite a complement here. So we have gross and net, we have negative gross and negative net set points. We also have accumulate and positive, negative, and percent relative set points. Pause, delay, wait, standstill, and counter. We have auto jog, center of zero, in motion, in range, batch and process, timer, concurrent, time of day set points. And finally, always and never set points. It's a pretty wide array of various set point types that will allow you to configure your batch routine to do just about anything. If I were to set up a gross set point, I would then be presented with the various options that go along with that set point, such as its value, trip conditions. You have the ability to trip higher, lower, in band, or out band. You can set hysteresis and pre-act values, alarm, we can clear the accumulator or tear, or we can push accumulator, push print, or push tear and perform those functions in our batch. You also have the ability to indicate the digital output that is going to be associated with your set points. And the 682 Synergy Plus has four digital IOs that come native that allow you to set up and work with your batch routine. Then we have the sense that you can choose to set there. You can include with the batch parameter whether or not a particular set point is included in a routine or if it needs to be a free running alongside of a batch routine that's running. We also have the ability to enable or disable that particular set point. And then we can indicate how the operator has access to the set points and if they're able to change them. Then we have an alias for that particular set point, so you can give it a name, refer to it, and then we come back around. So you can see there's many, many different parameters that you can set with the batch engine that comes along with the 682 Synergy Plus. Thank you for watching. And if you have any questions about how to configure your batch routine, feel free to call technical support at 1-800-472-6703.